Hey you guys, it's Aldo with PragerU. Today we're here at UC Berkeley to ask the students about traditional gender roles. Should we bring them back or shouldn't we? Men and women are at a loss for what roles they should be in and what roles they shouldn't. We can have women that are in the workforce, of course, and we can have men that stay at home. But I think it's important that we recognize the inherent differences that are in men and women and embrace them. It's gonna be a good one, let's go. Should we bring back traditional gender roles in society? No, by all means not. No. <laughs> Why not? Because we should have equal opportunities and equal chance, chances. I think that we've moved away from those roles for a reason. I think that they were oppressive towards women. It seems kind of lame to like to have the mom like stay at home and do nothing. It seems like kind of an unfulfilling life when you're not really like you're not really doing anything past like raising your kids. Like you're kind of like just a slave to like your husband, I would say. But if, if someone wants to like stay at home and that's what they want to do, then go for it. I, well, I think more broadly today, there's no expectations of what men should be and what women should be. And, you know, women can go out into the workforce, men can stay at home. But I think today we've, we've lost uh, the definition of what it means to be a man, what it means to be a woman, and what roles come along mm -hmm. with those genders. There are innate differences between men and women that make yeah. us men and Physical women. Physical differences, I'd agree with that. Yeah, but in biological differences that, that inform us of, of the things that we're good at. Do you think that we should return to traditional gender roles in society? 100 billion percent. People are happier when they have traditional gender roles. I think men and women's relationships, in the workplace, in every aspect of life, when people know their identity and like what they're supposed to be doing and where they're going to excel at, then I think people are going to be happier. Do you think that there are inherent differences in men and women that make us unique and that some things men are better at, some things women are better at? No. Do you think that there are any biological inherent differences between men that make men better at some things than women and women better at other things than men? Not necessarily. There are bio biological differences, but the, you have a wide variety uh, within each gender. So, I think at the moment men and women are so are like arch enemies and hate each other. But I think when women can fall into a traditional femin feminine roles and play these these roles that can complement men and men can play their roles. Not to say, you know, women couldn't work ever or whatever, but I think people would just be a lot happier. I think marriages would last longer. I think there would just be a lot less complication in life. So do you think that we should have equal representation in industries in our, in our society? Oh yeah, 100%. We have 93% uh, of construction jobs are men, 86% of uh, sanitation workers are men, and 86% of nurses are, are women. Mm -hmm. So should we be forcing women out, women out of nursing and into, into sanitation and into construction and, and bring some of those men into nursing? I think a lot of those statistics are just a product of like the culture that they were brought up in. Can you name three things that men are better at than women? It depends upon uh, what kind of upbringing they have had. That's what decides that they are better. You make gender this huge, huge big issue. The left does huge big issue. My gender this, my gender that. But then you're like forcing it, but you're, you're neglecting what your gender actually is. Everyone cares so much about gender, but they have no idea what gender they are or what it even means to be a particular gender. It's bad. I think it's negative. Can you name three things that men are better at than women? No, I don't think that it's like black and white like that. I think they're really good at protecting. I think they have the best sense of humor. They're very funny. You can't name three things that women are better at than men? No, I don't think it has anything to do with gender. I think naturally women are better at nurturing and listening, caretaking, maybe this like more gentle role, but I think women are also very good at organizing and things like that. So I would just say probably in general. Well, you guys, that's a wrap here at UC Berkeley. It was really difficult to get students to talk about this one, but I think that highlights what this was all about. Men and women are different, and I think it's those differences that make us special and make us unique, and we have to embrace those differences, not erase them. If you guys like this video, make sure to share it with your friends. Make sure to comment what you think about traditional gender roles. If you haven't done so already, make sure to download the PragerU app so you don't miss out on any more videos like this one. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Awesome, well, thank you so much, ma'am. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for watching this video. PragerU is a 501c3 organization. Help us keep our videos free by making a tax-deductible donation today. I appreciate your support.